fantastic day, but today's not just any day. Today's the day I go back to school from the best weekend ever. I still can't believe Ken opened up a pizza store. I can't wait to tell Tamika. Maybe she'll come after school for a slice. I better go get dressed. There we go, all dressed. Time to go start a fantastic day. Good morning, Barbie. Good morning, Skipper. Good morning, Stacy. Good morning, Chelsea. Your breakfast is on the table. Okay. So, Barbie, after school, are we going to walk home or to the pizza parlor? Uh, that's a good question, Chelsea. I think our shift runs till 5 o'clock today, so just walk to the pizza parlor. Okay. And if Tamika wants to, is it okay if she comes to the pizza parlor for a slice of pizza? Sure. Thanks. Well, Barbie, I'm already for school, so I'll see you later. Okay, bye. Bye. Oh, uh, I can't wait to do the weekend, I know, right? right? Nope, totally forgot. Class, you may talk amongst yourself for a few minutes. I'm not ready to start today's lesson yet. So how was your weekend, Chelsea? It was amazing. You will never guess what Ken did. What did he do? Guess. Um, he got you a new pet? No. I give up. He opened up a pizza restaurant. You're joking, right? No, he actually did. It's in downtown Malibu, and it's called Pizzazz Pizza. Oh my goodness, that's so cool. Now I can have free pizza every single day. No, I'm just kidding. No, of course you can have free pizza. Oh, really? Thanks. Would you like to come after school? I can show you a tour of the whole place. It's amazing. Yes, please. I love pizza. Class, class. Yes, yes. Thank you. Now, before I start today's lesson, there is a special announcement I have. What? Well, we have a new student joining our class. You can come in now, honey. Class, this is Olivia. Olivia, this is the class. Class, Olivia is new to our school. Olivia, would you like to tell us a couple things about you? Sure thing, Miss Vera. So, my name's Olivia Johnson. Um... I already lived in Malibu, but I just transferred schools. Um, my mom owns the best pizza restaurant in town. And, yeah, I really like school. And that's a few things about me. Thank you, Olivia. That sounds very interesting. You may go sit in that desk next to Veronica. class, now that that is all settled, you may turn to the person next to you and discuss the chapter of the book you were supposed to read over the weekend. Oops, I forgot to read the chapter, Chelsea. That's okay. I'll just tell you what happened. So basically, no, you don't need to tell me. It's okay. The teacher will go over it like she always does. Okay. So tell me more about your pizza shack. Pizza shack? Well, Ken's business is booming. Ken? Business? Booming? Wait a minute. That girl looks familiar. He even lets me take the customer's orders. Wait a minute. That's the girl who took me and Savannah's order. Wow, you're so lucky. Ken's probably like the best pizza restaurant in town. What? No, my mom's is the best. That place was trash. Ugh, I better tell my mom about this after school. Ugh, and put this girl in her place. I know, and excuse me? Oh, hi, Olivia. I couldn't help overhearing your conversation with the girl next to you, but do you know someone named Ken? Of course I do. He's my sister's husband. Does he own a pizza restaurant called Pizzazz Pizza? Uh-huh. You mean that junky little shack up the street? It's not junky, but yeah. Oh, well, my mom's restaurant is way better. Wait a minute. Didn't I take your order? And you said it was pretty good. No, I didn't. You must have been hearing things. So don't talk to me. And remember that I can destroy your business. It's not my business. It's Ken's. But if you say so. Jeez, some people can be so rude. I know. I don't know what her problem is. I was nice to her when I took her order. You're nice to everyone. Yeah. Just ignore her. She's probably jealous. Okay. But anyway, Chelsea... So where's Ken's Pizza Restaurant so I know where to meet you after school? Well, you can just walk there with me. Huh? Okay. Mm, I can't wait. Wait a minute. 
they're both going to that pizza shack after school. I better tell my mom this. All right, class, you are dismissed. We'll continue talking about this lesson tomorrow. Have a great day. Come on, Tamika, let's go. We want to be there before the lunch rush. Ugh, what are those two little brats up to? I need to tell my mom. Hi, Mom. Hi, honey. How was your first day at school? It was great, except one major problem. What? You know that new dumpy old pizza shack that's new up the street? Yeah. Well, the person who owns it somehow related to someone in my class. Oh boy. Yeah, and I couldn't o help overhearing that one girl's conversation. Her and her friend are gonna go to the pizza shack for lunch today. Oh. Yeah, and they're saying that it's getting popular. Huh? Yeah, that pizza shack is getting popular. I heard there's lines out the door. Oh dear, pack your bags. We're going to that pizza shack. <laughs> Good evening, Malibu, and welcome back to ABC7 News. Tonight, a very shocking business update. Right now, I'm at Malibu's new hit pizza restaurant, Pizzazz Pizza. Right now, there is a line out the door, and this restaurant hasn't even been open for 48 hours. I'm about to speak with manager Ken Carson. So, Ken, what made you decide to open up a pizza restaurant? Well, I always love making pizza, and my family says I'm a pretty good chef, so I thought this would be a good thing to try. Yeah, so what's this set of rules here? It's for my employees. Wow, you must run a pretty tight shift. We sure do. Well, that's it for today's report. Back to the weather. Guys, look! It's the news reporter from ABC7! Let's go get her autograph! Well, the line cleared. He was getting interviewed by ABC7. Yeah. Ugh, that should have been me. Yeah, don't worry, Mom. He'll be run down to business soon. I hope so. Oh, when are they going to come take our order? Welcome to Pizzazz Pizza, home of the Pizzazz Pizza. My name is Skipper. May I take your order? Finally, we would like a table, please. Yeah, right this way. So may I start you two off with something to drink? No, I don't want anything. Okay, would you like something? No. Would you like a uh, pink lemonade? I said no. Yeah, you need to listen. Oh, well, sorry. Did you just sass back to my daughter? Where's the manager? Mom, that lady's causing a scene. Just don't pay attention to her, son. What seems to be the problem over here? Uh, this employee keeps asking me and my daughter for a drink, and we don't want any. Skipper, I was just asking if they want to try your new pink lemonade. Skipper, come with me. Skipper, what does rule number nine say? Respect the customer. The customer is always right. I was not saying that to her. Uh, I'm sorry. Well, the customer is always right, Skipper. So I'm going to have to take the customer's word. Oh, I'm going to take my break then. Well, someone woke up on the wrong side of the bed. Stacy! Yes, Ken? Can you go take that lady and her daughter's order? Sure. Welcome to Pizzazz Pizza, home of the Pizzazz Pizza. My name is Stacy. May I take your order? Finally, some good service around here. Yes, we would like an extra large cheese and pepperoni pizza. Okay, coming right up. Barbie, we have an order for one extra large cheese pizza and one extra large pepperoni. Got it. All right, one extra large cheese and pepperoni pizza already. All right, here is one extra large cheese and pepperoni pizza. It's about time. Come on, Olivia, let's get out of here. Well, Olivia, are you ready? Ready for what? To find out what that guy puts in his junk pizza. Yeah, he'll be out of business by Wednesday.